to 57 years of Chelsea. Sit down and enjoy this amazing journey of the football kit's history. The lion motif was revived in 1967 and has remained the centerpiece of the club crest ever since. Throughout the 60s Chelsea rode high in the league and started to collect cup trophies. The League Cup in 1965 was followed by the FA Cup 1970 and the European Cup Winners Cup 1971. In the 1970-71 season, a small image of the FA Cup was embroidered next to the crest goal from the 1971-72 season. Two stars were added to represent these last two famous cup wins. In 1975, Chelsea were relegated to Division II, and although they returned for seasons later, in 1979 they went down again. After languishing in Division II for five seasons, Chelsea were promoted as champions in 1984. After two promising seasons, they went down once more, but won the second division championship the following season. And they have remained in the top flight ever since. By the mid-80s the board decided to update their image. And a new crest was designed that featured a lion leaping over the letters CFC. This appeared in various forms. With the lion rendered in white, red or yellow to match the accent color for that season. In 1986-87 Chelsea became the first club to market strips. Under their own name, the Chelsea Collection. At first these were without a sponsor, before by Linty. A slimming aid created by Peter Foster briefly appeared in early 1987. In 1994, Chelsea reached the FA Cup final once again, but lost heavily to Manchester United. Chelsea won the FA Cup in 1997, the League Cup in 1998 and the FA Cup once again in 2000. In 2003, Chelsea's long-standing and controversial chairman, Ken Bates sold the club to Roman Abramovich, a Russian oligarch reputed to be worth between up to 3.8 billion pounds. While the origins of Abramovich's wealth may be obscure, there was no doubt about his intentions as over the next few years, he poured huge amounts of cash into the club to enable them to sign some of the world's leading players. Indeed, at a time when the global transfer market was in recession, Abramovich's millions upped a trend propelling the one-time music hall joke into the elite of European football. After the appointment of the charismatic Portuguese manager, Jose Mourinho, Chelsea won the first of back-to-back -back Premier League titles in 2005, exactly 50 years after their first league title, followed by the FA Cup in 2007. In 2022 government had approved the sale of the club for £4.5 billion to Todd Bully, ending Abramovic's 19 years in charge.